Nation this morning. And this morning we're talking about an important medical mission in Nepal in South Asia. And joining us now is Dr. Ira Zunin. He's the medical director of the Manakai or Malama Integrative Clinic. Good morning, Dr. Zunin. Morning, Thank you so much for Thank joining you. us. So you went on this independent medical mission on your own without any other group. Uh, tell us how it started. Well, my, my 13 year old was with me. He's a mm -hmm. Waldorf student. So we went together. But um, we, we heard about this group that's six days away from from any health care, from, from any road. So we, uh, we decided to go ahead. We, we went, uh, flew to Kathmandu and uh, filled a helicopter full of, full of medicine. It was actually a kerosene helicopter, mm -hmm. kerosene run. Uh, flew up to this region and, and uh, we did what we could. And this was up in the Himalayas. Uh, that's your son right there amongst all those children, right? There he is, yes. Yeah. Uh, Waldorf School uh, uh, sewed, sewed some little, little uh, packets, for little bags for the, for the students there and gave them some beeswax crayons. Um, there he is giving that to the school. And these children and the people there, they don't have access to medical care. So what kinds of problems were you encountering in this village? Right. Well, we, we found kind of three groups of, of problems. The first was the lungs. Lots of TB, um, lots of bronchitis. These people have uh, lived by their dung fires and they have no chimneys in their homes. So, mm. so lots of respiratory issues. The second is um, is the belly, you know, uh, there's no good clean water, so lots of parasites, uh, lots of gastritis. And the third area is the joints. Um, lots of very, very small frame people carrying big loads through the Himalayas, so mostly knees, arms from chopping, uh, chopping wood, and, and necks from these baskets, these heavy baskets that they use to, to carry their load. Wow, and so you must have uh, trekked in uh, quite a bit of medical supplies to help these people? Well, we filled that helicopter. It was a kerosene helicopter, and we, we, uh, we packed it as tight as we could. Um, we actually had to leave our IV fluids back because uh, there, there just wasn't enough weight, weight capacity to get that high. I've known people who have gone to Nepal and the Himalayas, and they are struck by the people there. What was it like dealing with such uh, terrible medical conditions and dealing with the people there itself? Well, it was, it was, it was sad to not to be able to have the resources to help everybody that we, we knew we could help. Um, but the amazing thing is that they're so happy, so kind, and uh, really, really, they don't, they don't complain uh, mm -hmm. as much as we do in the islands. So it was just, it was amazing to see so much happiness and joy in people that were still so sick. All right. Well, Dr. Ira Zunin, thank you so much for joining us. I know you'd love to go back to I help will. them again. Thank you. And if you'd like to watch the segment again, you can check out our website, kitv.com, slash this morning, for all of our morning interviews, actually.